A car crashed into this Cotswold Bojangles and then caught fire. The driver managed to get out before firefighters arrived, but was still seriously hurt. Eyewitness News reporter Gina Esposito walks us through the series of events that followed the crash. Police is still investigating the cause of the crash, but from Randolph Road, we can see that a car may have traveled in this direction. You can see where it hit right here in the bark and then traveled down toward the side of the building where you can see this massive hole. There's now tape up around the building. Still a lot of debris besides it. This red VW bug crashed into this Bojangles restaurant on Randolph Road, then caught on fire. We arrived just as this ambulance was transporting its driver to the hospital with serious injuries. It happened during morning rush hour. That driver managed to get out quickly after crashing into the building. There was also a small fire inside the vehicle that left the driver's door charred. Marshall Thomas was gassing up across the street not long after. I'm not exactly sure how the accident happened, but I'm not surprised. Firefighters had to use a rope to pull the car away from the building so it could be towed away. Multiple investigators are now trying to put together the pieces. Right now, uh, we have uh, building and code enforcement, building inspectors um, out here on the scene along with health inspectors. Uh, so the business right now is closed. There was also significant damage done to the restaurant. The car crashed into the kitchen. Fortunately, no workers or customers were hurt, but the damage means frequent guests will have to eat somewhere else for the time being. I guess it'll be a while before I go back. Again, a lot of work needs to happen here before this Bojangles restaurant can reopen. I've reached out to Bojangles to find out when that will be. In Cotswold, I'm Gina Esposito, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Now, Channel 9 is checking with our sources tonight, trying to uncover the model year of the Beetle in that fiery wreck. In 2014, Volkswagen asked its dealers to temporarily stop selling four popular models, including the Beagle, Beetle, because of a fire risk. The car company said that a faulty O-ring can cause transmission fluid to leak in, quote, extreme situations. Now, 25,000 vehicles were impacted by this. We're asking whether the car that hit the Bojangles is impacted by this issue.